What is up everybody thank you for joining us yet again here at Fox Greens as you can see probably in the back right now we got some work going on there you go right now we're throwing down some mulch it's a nice sunny day thank you for joining us let's get to it Alrighty guys, so what we got here is a prep bed right now. So we edged it out pretty smooth right here on the walls of the bed. Right here, here you go. There's a nice little up and close view. All right. And we got some good depth here. So what I, what I want everybody to know, notice here is that right here at the bottom, we're, we're kind of doing a slow little incline up towards the center. You know, it's kind of going like this. The approach that we're taking today is that usually, usually what we would do with this mulch right here that's on the bed, on the back bed of our dump truck, we would usually dump it down onto the onto the driveway and then kind of like load it, load up our load up our cart from there. But the thing is, is that we figure, well, there's two factors that are in play here. Uh, first of all, the customer doesn't really want us to dump it too much because it leaves it dirty in the driveway. I mean, we obviously we always do our best to keep it clean and we do a little bit of cleanup, but there's always going to be some little residue that's left over that kind of washes away over time. But what we're trying to do today is leave it on the dump truck and then we're kind of like working with gravity in order to just bring it down little by little and then it's going to come into the, the cart. Um, like we'll, we'll put a cart right here. Uh, oh, here's one coming right now, so you're gonna see it.
quick update of how our work is going for the day. So we're just about finished from, with the front of the house right here. So here, here's a bed done, there's a bed done there. We still gotta do that one right there. Um, these main beds are done though, so that's a, a big progress that we've done. And nice little middle bed right here in the driveway. Uh, so what we gotta do now is that since we're, we're almost done with the front, we're gonna have to start transitioning over to the back. So we finally made our way back to the pool area and the, to the back, like I said, we we're gonna get here. All right, we're working nice and looking nice and good in the back. Look at this nice pool area. It's looking nice and clean. Dropping some mulch, make sure to keep this clean, leaving no mulch residue. <laughs> but you know, we're always gonna get a drop here and there, you know. There we go, we're working back here. Dropping some mulch. Look at this, guys. The white contrasts really well with the mulch. I'm loving it. Right here. Nice little setup. Looking nice. We're definitely gonna have to blow these steps right here once we're done. Drop quite a bit. But it's gonna happen, you know, as we're doing work. But we're making our way up steps, look at this. Nice and clean. Well, the beds, the, the, but the walkway is pretty dirty. Yeah, we're looking nice and clean. Right here, a little sky view right here. A little balcony view of the work. Check it out for yourselves. Make sure to clean those rocks guys. What we try to make sure to do while we're working on a customer's lawn and doing mulch and projects in the beds is that we do our best to make sure that any sort of ornament or decoration, any sort of decoration that they may have on their beds that we try to keep them as clean as possible and clean to the point that we leave them as they were before we started the, the job. So for example, these rocks, there was quite a bit of mulch on them and as you saw we just we just blew it off. The important thing to keep in mind is that when you're using the blower just do a little slight tap on that trigger. You know a slight tap and hold because you don't want to go full force when you're trying to do like little cleanups on on these little rocks or whatever it may be because uh, you yeah you're gonna clean off the rock but you don't also want to undo the work that you do that you just did. Like right here, you know, if you kind of, if you blow too hard, you're probably going to clean out the edges over uh, around the rock as well. So just make sure to clean on the decoration itself, not, uh, not around the bed. Because it's going to cause more work and take more time for the project. Thank you for joining us on yet another mulch adventure that we kind of had today. We're going to finish this video off with showing the finished product, maybe couple of drone shots the drone shots are back um, and until next time take care bye